Let me show you how you can create this nostalgic looking flip clock on your Excel worksheet. Let's start from the very beginning. There's this function called now. If you enter them, you can see that it'll give you your current system date and time. Over here, we're going to extract hour. To extract hour from now, you're going to say hour now function as an argument. Hit enter. It will extract the hour from your system date and time. You get minute. Simply say minute now as an argument and hit enter. It will give you your current minute. Let's go ahead uh, and uh, do the uh, formatting for the cell. Highlight this two cell here. Change the font to impact and change the fill color to this RGB number and the font color to this RGB number. At this moment, you can see there's no leading zeros in our minutes. What you do is that you press Control one while selecting this two cell. Under number tab, go to custom and change the type to zero zero and click on OK. You will see leading zero on both your minutes and hours. Let's increase the font size a bit. I'm going to say about 42 and then align this to be center middle. Next, we'll introduce the day of the week on this cell and meridian indicator on this cell here, which is your AM PM. Copy and paste the hour cells right below it and another one right below the minute and reduce the font size for both of these new cells. And finally, align the cell to be center and middle. To get the day of the week, you're going to say X open parenthesis and the first argument there will be now and you put four d's like this to give you the full spelling for the day of the week for the every rated version of day of the week just put three d's like this i'm going to design my day of the week to show the full spelling and for meridian it's quite simple you're going to use an if statement here and use the same formula as before if your hour now which is simply going to give you your current hour if it's less than 12 which means it is still in the am session if it's more than 12 of course it's going to be on the pm session close parenthesis and hit enter as you can see this is 10 o'clock at night so sorry showing as pm next we'll insert a rounded rectangle here by using our illustration and place a rounded rectangle right above the hour cell and press Control one on your keyboard it's so going to say no fill and change the line color to this hex number and then after that, I'm going to try to increase the thickness of that line as much as I can so that I do not see any white lines between that rounded rectangle and the cell. And last but not least, to duplicate the rounded rectangle for the minute cell, hold down your Control and Shift on your keyboard, left mouse click and drag that rounded rectangle over the minute cells and let go of your left mouse button. And do a bit of cleanup here. There you go. Job complete.